With RIT coach Jay Kuhn, nobody can certainly accuse your kids of not emptying the tank. I mean, they certainly did that. What a game. What did we see out here for the past 60 minutes? Yeah, it was a pretty impressive game uh, by both teams, I felt. Um, a lot of turnovers by both, but I think that's uh, you know a result of just the speed of play. Uh, guys are up and down all day long. Um, you know, we had a great first half. We were running, running, gunning, and, and getting our transition. The second half, um, we just weren't connecting on the transition, and you know they were winning faceoffs all day, which was giving them a lot of, a lot of possessions, and, and that was tough to, uh, you know, kind of deal with for the entire day. Um, kind of different from yesterday. I mean, sure. we had, we had the ball all day, so um, you know we played a lot of defense against a wonderful offense, and, and when you have opportunities to, you know, bury balls in the second half, and we didn't do it and gave the ball back to them, that's uh, that's on us. Obviously a game where, obviously, up and down the field, the efficiency of both teams shooting the ball certainly speaks to their skill. But have you ever seen anything like that where both teams were so efficient at shooting the ball? You get a lot of shots sometimes in a game, but both teams are very efficient. I saw it last year in this game. <laughs> uh, it seems like it's like that every time we play. Um, you know, both teams have great athletes and, and great lacrosse players. Um, you know, whoever executes more and whoever comes up with more GBs and, and – uh, you know, buries those shots is going to come out on top, and and I, you know, they did that especially in the second half today. I know it's painful to lose, but what do you take from this weekend? Because your kids did a lot of good things here. No doubt, I you got to take a bunch of positives from it. Um, you know, uh, I, there's no doubt we have a group that's that's hardworking. Um, they're they're putting forth their best effort. They're buying in. Uh, we're proud of them for that. You know, we. It's, we saw it yesterday. You know, uh, a guy like Pat Shumay, uh had a great day yesterday. He's battling with a hamstring. He, sure. You know, he plays two days back to back with a hamstring and he played fantastic. So um, we've, we're gritty. Uh, I think we're gritty off the ground. Um, at the same time, I think there's some stuff to work on. Um, our transition game with our D middies, we, we've got to be cleaner. Um, we're, we're just not quite as clean as we have been in the past. Uh, we're making mistakes in the clearing game and in the transition game, and I think that's something we really need to improve upon. All right, appreciate the time. Best of luck the rest of the year. Okay, thank you very much. All right, Jay Kuhn from RIT as they get a split here on the weekend at the Mustang Classic.